You would not believe the crazy weather that delayed our train. <laughs> Came out of nowhere. But it was all worth it to see this peaceful little angel. Aw, oh, so sweet. Come to your grandmare. <laughs> Wonder when we'll see home again. Sure. <laughs> Yeah. No! <laughs> huh? We have Sunburst to thank for that. I hope he takes his role as Crystaller seriously. Something tells me the baby will need a pony like him to look to for magical advice. Caden Starling. Are we gonna name the poor little dear, or are we gonna spend the entire visit just calling her the baby? We were thinking... Flurry Heart. You know, to remember the occasion. <laughs> Goodness, how could any pony forget? <laughs> well... Well, I think you're the Crystal Empire's big, important wizard. Whether you like it or not. Oh, I don't know if I'll have time for any wizarding. I'm a crystaller now. That's a big responsibility. I can't think of any pony more qualified. Just promise you'll stay in touch? <laughs> like I'd ever lose touch with my oldest friend. What's wrong, Twilight? I don't know, Spike. I think I have a lot to learn about being a teacher. What are you talking about? Your lesson went perfectly. Starlight and Sunburst got over their past and rekindled their friendship. No thanks to me. I know a lot happened. I just wish I could have given my pupil the attention she deserves. Well, I know she needed to be put on the right path. But giving her the space to make her own decisions worked pretty well. Isn't that how Celestia taught you? You know, I never thought about it, but I guess it is. Maybe you're a better teacher than you thought. 